It's 104.3 Now FM Vegas. It's Hit Music Channel. Andy Gill, Midday Getaway. Getaway guests, we got Tanache in the studio. What up? How How's are you? Going? Good. Ready for the big show tonight? Oh, yeah. It's going to be crazy. Now, I just I looked at the schedule, and of course, it just showed me Vegas. Mm -hmm. This isn't this isn't kicking it off, right? You've been doing shows. Yeah. This is kicking it off? No, 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 no. Oh, okay. No, so, yeah, we've been on tour. Where did you guys come from before here? Uh, did you perform last night is what yeah. I should ask. Did you, I'm like, I don't even remember where we were yesterday. Was it last night that you performed? No, it was the day before. So you got a break. Yeah, we had, we had a one day of travel day. We were in Denver. That's okay. where we were. <laughs> Cracking Denver. Me up. <laughs> so um, let me ask you a question. Have you ever uh, uh, you know, been at a concert and said the wrong city? Um, Not totally, but kind of. Uh, one time I was in, in Europe and I was like outside of London and I said London, but that was close. Uh, that so I feel count. like I, I got like a break. I didn't say like the completely wrong city. Europe's all the same stuff. It's all good. Like knock on wood. <laughs> yeah. Be like, damn, Andy, mess me up. <laughs> um, tell me about Vegas. Do you get the chances to come here much besides yeah. working? Yeah, I, mean, I mean, I live close by in okay. LA, so yeah. it's, not, it's not far to to come up and okay. hang, so it's fun, yeah. All right, cool. So now you said live in L.A. I know you were born in Kentucky. I was. Were you born and raised in Kentucky? No, I only lived there for three months. Oh, okay. All right, I was going to tease you about some sports stuff, but we'll <laughs> leave it at that. Um, so uh, tell me about Joyride. Joyride is the new album, you know, I've been working on for a while. I'm super excited about. Um, yeah, it's got a lot of songs that, you know, I really put my heart and soul into. I hope people are excited about it, but I'm playing some of the songs from the new album at the show okay. so definitely come by and, and check it out tell me about the album not you not a lot of not as many collaborations as the last album probably remember? not i mean i'm more just focused on you know just myself and just creating great music okay i don't think it necessarily needs to have collaborations to be awesome so you know if it feels right then then we'll, we'll yeah. do it do you have fun making it I definitely, yeah, I loved it. I'm, I'm still excited, you know, for everybody to hear it. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna, I have to ask you the question. I'm sure you're tired of it. Do you, any kind of ballpark figure or date when we're gonna get it? I don't have any date as of now. Okay. So yeah, I don't, can't tell you anything. All right. Sorry, but it's, it's all good. It's soon. all good. Very soon, so stay tuned. Any questions with you on this tour and promoting the new album that you hate it when DJs ask you? I don't know. I just, I don't like getting asked like relationship questions. Okay, fair enough. Kind of fair enough. Irrelevant. Yeah. Do you get that a lot? <laughs> I mean, yeah, a lot of people ask me like if I'm in a relationship. All the Try time. to dig into it? Yeah. Okay. I mean, I have nothing to report anyway, so it's always a very disappointing a answer from my, <laughs> from my end. <laughs> um, you know, you're doing a lot. Like I said, uh, I was teasing you how busy you are. Um, talk to me about the fashion industry and what you got going on. Yeah. Um... Fashion wise, I mean, I've really been able to, you know, do a lot of things collaboratively with with brands and things like that, which I'm like really excited about. And um, yeah, I've done a lot of like fun campaigns, cool campaigns and got some exciting stuff coming up. And yeah, I don't know. I can't say much. <laughs> Can you talk about the Ralph Lauren denim and all that? Yeah, stuff that I mean, the Ralph Lauren denim supply campaign was really dope. Um, yeah, it was fun to be a part of just like, you know, making you know, being the face of any type of brand is, is really Pretty cool. Pretty so, cool. Yeah, it was fun. Uh, Mac Makeup? Mac Makeup. I mean, I'm just going down the list here. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, no, that's awesome. I got to collaborate with Mac and create my own eyeshadow palette, like a nine-color eyewear palette, which was really fun because I got to, you know, be uh, creative and definitely have, like, my input in, okay. in creating the product. So I feel like it's... Um, definitely very true to me and you know hopefully all the fans you can go get it order it online all that good stuff i'll make sure to do that um, yes do now, it now <laughs> now something pretty cool that i was you know doing some research looking at some other interviews and i know you're in a group when you started uh -huh. um and you also got to open for some you know big names bieber nikki katie yeah what's it like to be your own thing like finally yeah. like it's it's, it's fun tinashe and it's no awesome. one else i mean it, i want to pick a, who's opening for me yeah there's you know? a different energy when you're doing your own show versus when you're opening for people i think opening for people is a great experience because it gets you in front of like other fans and you know gives you that exposure but at the same time you know performing for your own fans people who are there 100 percent to see you it's just a different energy everyone's super pumped up and and it feels feels good it's much more fulfilling yeah. Now you're gonna be on tour for a while. Um, you also have another side to you, and that's acting. Yeah. Um, it, hard question to answer. Which one do you like better? Definitely music. Okay. Yeah, music is much more fulfilling for me. I mean, I took a step back from acting for a while um, to focus on music. So uh, yeah, I'll get back into it maybe in the future. But 
Music is definitely. With somebody as talented as yourself, do you find one more challenging than the other? Um. Mm, I mean, I think the music industry is more challenging. I think so it's more the business just side more, than... less regulated okay. um, than the, the, the movie business, the acting business. I feel like, you know, there's a lot of just like rules and regulations that, and it makes everything just more professional and smoother. The music industry is just kind of like a free for all. So there's just a lot of like crap that you have to like figure out and deal with. Um, so I definitely think it's harder, but it's more fulfilling, like I said, for me to, okay. to create music and to... Yeah, like create something that means something to people. Cool. You know, you get you could compare, compare it to Aaliyah. You know, the Sierra. What what you want to be your own person? Is there That's anything nice. out there that tries that? How would you describe yourself? If you're like, what kind of music do you make? You know, you I get everything that's you know the um, R and B is there, but I mean, is it? Yeah, I mean, it's rooted in that place, but I feel like you know, there's a lot of influence from different genres, whether it be like hip hop or pop or alternative. So it's kind of like a melting pot. I don't really like label myself one particular genre. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. Well, thank you so much for getting in here. Thank you. All right, taking yeah, time. I, I know you're busy. It. I know you're doing the rounds out here in Vegas. Absolutely. Um, please be safe and get out of Vegas as soon as you can. <laughs> no, come through to the show today. <laughs> for sure. Um, are you gonna do anything? After is there anything I mean, that we may be partying, we're maybe hitting, you know, the the roulette table. Oh, who knows? So, come so you got up. a little bit of gambling in you too, I huh? I mean, when what happens in Vegas? All right, you said roulette, so, re- so you said roulette, so red or black? Black. <laughs> oh yeah. All day. All day. Okay, I like that, Tanasha. Thank you so much. Thank you.